this is a bright shirt. I'm like glowing right now. Hey, it's me. If you are one of my regular viewers, thank you for coming back yet again. Are you gonna be back next week too? You may notice that I am not posting on my regular post day. This is more of a life update. Therefore, I shall give the normal disclaimer because every time I do any kind of life, life update, update, I always get the people who are like, I literally don't care about your life at all. Why are you telling us this? Just go back to painting something. That's all you're good for. I get you, that's totally fine. However, there are some people who do care, I think. So this video is for them. If you're not one of them, I will see you on Friday because that's when I post my regular entertainment content. Back to the topic of this video. Let me not drag this on. I am pregnant. I'm pregnant again. Did you notice? the slight weight gain, the oversized sweaters that I've been wearing the last couple weeks. If you did, congratulations. You're observant. I do have a daughter already. Every time I mention her, I get a lot of people saying like, I didn't know you had a kid. I did not announce when I was pregnant with her and I have an entire video explaining that story. If you wanna watch it, I will link it for you. But yes, I do have a daughter already. She's just under two. We're doing this pretty close together. It's gonna be interesting. Yay! This time is not gonna be be a secret, I am just gonna be pregnant on camera and you're gonna see me in full bloom. <laughs> This pregnancy is different because it's my second pregnancy. I've done this before. Also, this one was planned. I wasn't like caught off guard and flabbergasted. Let me try to just answer some of the basic questions that I think people may have. One, how pregnant am I? I don't know exactly when I'm gonna get around to editing and posting this video, but currently as I'm filming, I am 18 weeks pregnant. I am just about halfway there. When is my due date? My due date is August 25th. However, however, I don't want anyone getting too caught up on that date. If you're not super familiar with pregnancy and childbirth, a due date, it's just an estimate, and it's actually pretty uncommon to actually have the baby on your estimated due date. Don't be blowing up my DMs on August 25th being like, congratulations for having the baby. I don't know if I'm gonna have a baby that day. Probably I won't. It's probably gonna happen either up to two weeks before that date or two weeks after that date. There's a big range and I do know that I am having another girl. So I'm going to have two daughters. Yay! I'm excited that Mini Me is gonna have a sister very close in age. They're gonna be best friends. Hopefully. How is this going to change my content? If you were here while I was pregnant the first time and you didn't know, it's because it didn't change my content at all. I'm gonna still do this. It's not gonna change much besides the fact that you will watch me get rounder for several months. I would would like to do one fun video that's kind of about being pregnant. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. It can be related to art or not related to art. I don't have any intention of making this a pregnancy or baby channel or family channel. No huge changes are going to be made to my content, but I do think it would be fun to just do one video that's like kind of about me being pregnant. I also want to do a video painting some paintings for the new baby's nursery. I did paint for Minnie Me's nursery when I was pregnant with her. Other than those two videos, I don't think anything else is gonna be disrupted during my pregnancy. I think I'm just gonna keep on rolling. What happens once the baby is born? That question is a little bit harder for me to answer. I have done the whole newborn thing before, but every baby is different. I also already have a very young child to take care of as well, so that's gonna be very different. I do intend on canceling the video the week of the baby's birth. I I did this my first time. You guys just didn't know the actual reason why I canceled the video. It was nice to just have one week where I didn't have to worry about an upload at all. I'm in the hospital and I'm trying to recover. I don't intend on having a long extended maternity leave. I'm gonna be working to try to get ahead and film some videos ahead so that I have videos ready for when the baby comes and hopefully I can take a little bit of a break but still be posting videos. Last time I posted every single week except for the one where I was in labor. It's gonna be a little harder this time because I have a child that I need to take care of. So if I'm getting close to my due date and I'm realizing eh, this is just not gonna happen, I'm not getting enough videos saved up, I think what I'm gonna do is do half length videos. So I would still be posting every single Friday at 4 p.m. They would be the same exact 
quality and editing style just a little bit shorter. So my goal is to post every single Friday as usual. And if I'm a little bit low on time, I'm just gonna have to do shorter videos for a couple months after that things should return completely to normal. Anyone who is concerned that I'm going to be overworking, chill. I am totally fine. I will definitely take care of myself and make sure that I'm not exhausting myself. People love to ask you, how are you feeling? Um, so thank you for asking that. <laughs> I'm feeling great. I'm feeling so much better now. The first trimester was a little bit more difficult on me. My first pregnancy, I completely locked out. I had a very, very easy pregnancy. This time I did have a lot of them morning sickness. Morning sickness is not a morning thing. It's actually just, just a sick thing. I'm not, not sure, sure why, why they call it morning, morning sickness. sickness. I actually felt the best in the morning and throughout the day I would get sicker and sicker and sicker until the evening where I was actually throwing up. In addition to some pretty uncomfortable fatigue that I was having. <laughs> On certain days, it almost felt like I had the flu. My symptoms were definitely stronger this pregnancy. The good news is I used to have a fear of throwing up. It's gone. <laughs> fear knocked out. I still got through it. I still posted a video every week. We are past that now. I'm not nauseous. I'm not fatigued. We're in a good place. Can we see the belly? Nobody wants to ask, but everyone wants to see it. So sure, this is the belly. This is what 18 weeks of pregnancy looks like on me. It'll get much larger. It's not at full capacity right now. Fetus is the size of a large onion currently. So I think that about covers it. I just wanted to update you guys. I will see you guys on Friday for a regular video. Bye.